February 1945, the Yalta Conference. Leaders from the United States, the United Kingdom and the Soviet Union were mapping out the future of Europe after the end of World War II. How the Big Three, as they came to be known, dictated the course of war has been the subject of intense study and speculation. Now, hundreds of declassified documents from the British National Archives are providing an unprecedented look at what used to be secrets. One account explains how a frosty meeting between Winston Churchill and Joseph Stalin in 1942 turned the corner. It read, There I found Winston and Stalin sitting with a heavily laden board between them, food of all kinds and innumerable bottles. Everything seemed to be as merry as a marriage bell. They stay there till three o'clock in the morning, then uh, disappear, go back uh, to their apartments. But the next day, Churchill and Stalin are the best buddies, so they sort of hit it off over a good uh, drinking session. Other unearthed documents reveal that Britain's secret intelligence service, MI6, had an assassination list of prominent German figures in preparation for the D-Day landings. Those plans were eventually abandoned. But on the whole, over the, you know, what have we got, 60, 70 years, this type of material tends to lose its sensitivity. And it does also need the political will to release this type of stuff. And luckily, the Cabinet Office were very keen to uh, transfer the material here and open it. World War II was fought over six years and claimed an estimated 70 million lives. The newly released papers are a lens into what went on at the highest levels of decision-making and show, in at least one case, how a few drinks may have changed the course of history. Gerald Tan, Al Jazeera.